Hi, and welcome to another episode of the Aruba What is NAS two minute video series. I'm Alan, and I'll be your host. Today's topic is what's the difference between SAS, IAS, and NAS? Wow, is Dr. Seuss in the house? Can we have more acronyms, please? As the service offerings are growing quickly, creating a bit of alphabet soup, let's look at each of these terms individually because some of them can be confusing. Some of the terms even overlap. SaaS stands for Software as a Service, and it spans the gamut of all software applications in the cloud. SaaS covers any software function accessed and utilized over the internet, from modern CRM tools you may use at work to the countless applications we use to the internet every day. And yes, cloud-based network management meets this definition of SaaS as well. IaaS, which stands for Infrastructure as a Service, is defined as the use of any IT hardware and software components to the cloud. Similar to SaaS, it's an all-inclusive category that can span the entire IT infrastructure portfolio from compute to storage to networks. Finally, there's NAS, which stands for Network as a Service. NAS is much more specific as it relates to network infrastructure only. Unlike SaaS and IaaS, NAS refers only to network hardware, software, and services delivered in a cloud-like motion, which involves subscription payments and consumption-based billing. Sometimes NAS even includes the overall day-to-day -day management of a networking environment by a third party. So there you have it. A quick rundown of the differences between SaaS, IaaS, and NAS. Keep in mind that while SaaS and IaaS are more general terms that span different functions accessed and managed over the internet or cloud, NAS is specific to networking. Till next time.